hey guys cc here back with another video for the channel so welcome back to the channel guys in today's video we'll be making some beetroot and carrot juice beetroot so we have a beetroot right here i already went ahead and washed my fruits and cut them up so that's the beetroot and then you have the carrot i have some lime some ginger and that's it so today i'll be using my ninja blender let's get started so for the carrot i just peel i go ahead and scrape off the skin you can use a peeler but i think that would be taking off too much skin so this is a better method for me just doing this last one Hi Latte, that's my cat. What's wrong? You hungry? Give me a minute, Latte. Okay. While I feed Latte, okay. what you need to do now is let's get this one. Okay. You could add your carrot. So why I'm adding carrot to the beet juice is because the beet is so strong, it has a rich taste. So once you add the carrot and the ginger, it kind of helps the juice to taste a little better, like it's more tolerable. <sighs> you could tolerate the taste more. And then you'll add some water. So beetroot and carrot actually have a lot of benefits. It's so good for the body. I'll definitely link some benefits here. So I drink this maybe twice or four times a month, maybe for the health benefits. Some people actually save the trash, as I was saying and they add water to it and strain it again to make sure they get all the juice out but i don't want to do that i'm just going to use whatever i get the first time Let's just put it all in. Okay, that should be it for this.
this is actually the tedious part this is the long process actually straining because it doesn't take too long to blend but then straining afterwards that's the time killer but this is about to taste so good oh my god i'm definitely pouring i'm definitely wasting beets because this is so red it's not supposed to be that red like it could definitely re-blend and get more juice out of it. so i guess that's why they do it twice actually in jamaica we have strainer of course but when you're making drinks like this we normally use not a t-shirt we use a fine cloth to strain the juice instead of a strainer i think that's faster and i have those i have a marina we call it marina but here in the bahamas they call it singlet so actually i'm gonna strain with the singlet after this one and see it's just a little bit messy but this is working my arm with the spoon like i definitely think i'm gonna redo those because that's a lot of juice in that so let's use the singlet one minute so this is a singlet marina shirt that I just cut open. You can see. So yes, I do make these drinks often. So I do have one of these. So I'm going to just give it a quick wash, rinse, and then I'll be back. Let's move that to the side. And you just pour it in. And right away, I'm getting way more juice out of it than with the strainer. So I think I'll stick to this method. Still working my arms, but I'm getting way more juice. So just dump it out. Definitely make sure your hands are clean. Can you see the difference with how rich in color this trash is versus can't really see this one? So definitely a lot more juice in that, but we're not gonna stress over that. We're gonna move on and go to a lime. I normally use one and a half lime, sometimes two, but you could taste as you go. Oh, these limes are not juicy. <laughs> So I think I need to just use the full two lines. Who would have thought making juice is a workout like right now? This is a workout with this lime. So you're working out and then you get to drink your healthy juice. Okay guys, so once you're finished straining your drinks, 
then it's time to sweeten it so I'll be using some sugar one spoon since it's just a cup There you have it, your beet juice. Tastes real good. It'll taste better once it's chilled. Mm. Mm -hmm. Definitely tastes good. So there you have it. Thank you guys for watching and I hope you guys will try this recipe home and enjoy the benefits of beet juice and carrot juice. Thanks again for watching guys. If you're new, please don't hesitate to like, comment and subscribe. Turn your notification bell on so you don't miss the next time we upload. And welcome to the family.